What is up guys, all on text here. Today I am back with another video and this video is The Gun Mode version 2 made by me. So first, uh, you're gonna get yourself a block launcher app and you're gonna go to mod PS script and you're gonna go to downloads and you're gonna find the Element X Gun Mode version 2 mod PKG. So you don't need any texture packs for this gun mode because the texture pack is inside the mod PKG. So you only need to do one thing and yeah, you're good. So first you're gonna enter a world and if you enter a world then it's gonna say something like uh let's wait this gun mod creator element x to slash help to get uh help for this gun mod so yeah this is so much better like the old version was so much messier so so i'm just gonna clear my inventory to show you guys how to get everything so i'm just gonna clear so i'm gonna be showing you guys how to do this thing so i'm gonna do slash help because uh i'm just gonna do slash help because why not slash help so look at this first slash creator watch the video on how to play this game and the information about this creator i'll do uh creator first create if you click how to play this mod then this video is gonna pop up all right and then the next command i'm gonna show you guys is slash give and if you do slash give then six guns magazines and ammunitions are gonna pop up like this so i'm gonna first go over the ak 47. Oh my god, this is a Russian accent right there. Did I do it right? I don't know. <laughs> so AK-47 uses the 762 by 39 mm ammunition and then not this guy. It uses this magazine. 762 by 39 magazine. So I'm just gonna click the magazine on the ground to reload this magazine and the maximum is 30 rounds. To reload this gun, you're gonna click the mag button to aim this is gonna pop up so it works like this the next one is the Smith & Wesson model 686 357 magnum revolver so this gun does not have a magazine because revolvers don't use magazines so if you press the magazine button, then nothing's gonna happen. The revolver round is 357 Magnum. So to open the cylinder, you're gonna do open cylinder and put the round in, close cylinder, and you're going to fire. I don't know why the arrow is not disappearing. I think there's a bug. I'll fix it in the next version. So yeah, this is how it works. So in the real life, the ammunition doesn't go away like this. So what happens is the cartridge case stays in the cylinder, but you guys can see the primer has been struck by the uh, striker or the hammer. So I'll be adding that in the next version. So you have to uh, eject the empty case by uh, manually and yeah. But this thing is pretty realistic. So if you do this and fire, this is gonna happen. So it's like really, really, really realistic. Next one is a 6 hour P226. This is a magazine and it uses the 9mm uh, cartridge. 9mm by 90mm. So to load this thing, it's the same. Just click the ground, 19 rounds, and then press the mic button and it's going to load the gun for you. So it was at this. Pretty cool. It can one shot normal zombies like this because the real guns are pretty strong and it can one shot pretty much every single thing next one is the accuracy international awm and uses uh the 330 lapua magnum there are uh 300 winchester magnum awms but i just decided to use the 330 lapua magnum because why not to load this thing click the ground in five rounds at the maximum and you're gonna do mag uh, if you're into snipe, then you can do scope. Pretty uh, strong. Like this. Pretty, pretty, pretty strong. And this is a 329x40x scope. Kind of like a 329x40x uh, mill.reticle scope. 
Next one is the Heckler & Coke HK416. I added the red dot to this thing. So, yeah. So it uses a 556 by 45 uh, millimeter NATO round and to load this thing, use the 556 by 45 magazine like this. All right, and then press the mag button and it's going to load it for you. To aim, you're gonna do this and it's gonna bring up the red dot. Pretty cool, isn't it? Full auto is also possible and yeah. Pretty cool. And if you run out of ammunition, then it's gonna say no rounds, extract magazine. Click the mag button on the left and it's gonna pull out the magazine. Oh, and by the way, uh, you can extract the magazine even if you don't use up the whole magazine now. So 15 rounds are loaded in the magazine as you see, and if I uh, press the mag button, then 15 rounds are gonna be added in the gun. And if I pull out the magazine, then there's gonna be 14 rounds in the magazine because the one round is chambered in the chamber in the gun. And same goes with shotguns, Heckler & Coke, uh, AWM, SIG, AK-47. So there's one round in the gun right now, so there's no magazine in the gun right now. So if I uh, shoot, then only one round is gonna go out because there's one round chambered in the chamber, just like the real gun. So it's like really, really accurate to the uh, actual guns in real life. Now 14 rounds in the magazine. So right now there are 13 rounds in the magazine and one round in the chamber, adding up to 14 rounds total. So you can basically uh, load up to thir 31 rounds in one gun. Uh, Heckler & Co. 416 because, yeah, you know. For the shotgun, you're gonna use, uh, it's gonna use the 12 gauge uh, shotgun shell. And you're gonna click magazine and yeah, you're gonna go bag and it's gonna load up the shotgun shell for you. The shotgun does spread but not as much as uh, in games. Because this is how much the shots spread in real life. The next one I'm going to be showing you guys is the CK1 command. The CK1 command allows you to get HK, SIG, and then Remington. So the magazines are already loaded up for you guys so you can reload really quickly. So I think that's like a uh, problem for the for the version 1. So you guys need to load up every single magazine which was pretty which was pretty annoying. So once you use up all of the magazine ammunition the magazine then you can load it up really quickly just like this CK2 gives you AK-47 AWM and and the Smith & Wesson revolver AWM and AK-47. So that's pretty cool. Oh, let's kill some pumpkins. It's October. So that was basically it for today's video, guys. And see you guys in the next video.